Hi everyone! I just dressed nine of my American Girl dolls into some festive winter outfits. Whether they're having a day downtown or playing in the backyard snow, they're certainly in the frosty spirit. In this video, I'm going to be showing you what they are wearing. Every winter, American Girl comes out with some sort of winter outfit for the My American Girl dolls, so these three are all wearing outfits from different years. This is Taylor May, and she's a truly me at number 66. She's wearing these fluffy white earmuffs that you can purchase separately, which totally complement this outfit from 2012. This sweater has super fun texture and has silver sparkles all throughout it, and the curvature of this fuzzy white skirt reminds me of a snowball. You gotta cover those legs if you're gonna be playing in the snow, so it has these leg-long white leggings, and then these boots are a pale lavender color with a soft suede fuzz on the top. This is my Truly Me number 46 named Alex, but I purchased her as a 2017 Girl of the Year Gabriella as they are the same doll. She is wearing this winter white outfit from 2014 and her hair is in these two fun snow buns. I think this hairstyle looks pretty cute on her and I think it definitely goes with the outfit. This soft fuzzy vest is one of my favorite things American Girl has designed for the winter. It has this fun tulle flower in the upper corner and then the belt is a tie ribbon with a two on each side. And I love how instead of just doing a basic white long sleeve shirt underneath, they added these big puffy sleeves. These white sweater shorts are so stylish, and I love that American Girl does a whole bunch of different types of winter outfits because I feel like we usually think about long pants for the winter, but they have been doing shorts and skirts with leggings underneath. There are also a few sequins on the right hand side. And to finish off this all white look, we have a pair of leggings and boots, and I really like how they coordinated the puffy sleeves with the boot tops. Ashley is my My American Girl doll number 38, and she is wearing the 2016 Enchanting Winter Outfit. Everything except the headband. I just decided not to put it on her, but this is what it looks like. It's soft and fuzzy and has this white satin inside. I love the mix of textiles on the sweater. There's sparkles in all of the ribbing, so it's the cuffs, the bottom, and the collar. But then it's just plain white for the sleeves, and the center is obviously this really soft, fuzzy material. I just think that mix of fabrics is really fun, especially paired with this light blue quilted skirt. And as a side note, I think the silver American Girl branding looks really nice on this instead of the clear one. The leg long leggings are the same frosty blue as the skirt, and these white boots have the fuzz on the top and some beads on the side. As you can see, it's this really cute bow, and the material is more of a suede. And just as a comparison to the winter white outfit, you can see the winter white boot is a lot taller, this fuzz is a lot longer, and the material of the boots is different. These two girls are ready to hit the town in their cute poncho outfits with tall boots. Luciana is girl of the year 2018, and she is wearing the sightseeing outfit from 2005. And Maria Grace is a historical doll from 1853, and she is wearing the cozy plaid outfit from 2010. This light blue beret is super stylish, especially paired with Luciana's side bangs. The material is really soft and kind of feels like if you brushed out yarn. I really like all of the small details on this dusty rose poncho, such as the fact that it looks like it's crocheted, the fake flower with the fake pearls inside, and the tassels on the ends. But when you put all those things together, it kind of reminds me of something old-fashioned as a lot of those things were trendy back in the day. The undershirt is a long sleeve cream top with a high neck, and the material is really thick and soft, so it kind of reminds me of something you would find at an athletic shop. I really like all the subdued colors in the outfit and then the big pop of blue in the skirt. It is definitely a unique style, kind of like a cut off mermaid skirt and the lining is satin. And if you can see, all of the pattern on the fabric is stitching. And to finish it all off, we have these tall light blue boots with a round buckle. Marie Grace is a recent addition to my collection. I got her off of eBay for retail price and she is essentially new as the seller said that she was a display doll. I haven't had the heart to take out her meat hairstyle yet, so I had to put her in a pink outfit to match the pink bows. This plaid capelet is definitely a staple in my collection, as I've had it for quite a few years. i played with it so much over the years that two buttons have fallen off. I've sewn one back on, but I still have to sew back on the other one. The undershirt is just a basic long sleeve white shirt, but I always know which outfit it goes with because of the pink American Girl branding on the side sleeve. This bright pink skirt goes with the pink ribbons in Murray Grace's hair, and it has three pleats on either side. And one of my favorite boots of all time are these lavender boots. They have the scrunched up front, and I just think they're really stylish. And these last four dolls are just wearing some fun outfits for the winter. First up is my Beef River Samantha. She has some of the most gorgeous hair around, but I've decided to put in some pigtails. 
This sporty purple vest with fleece lining is from the Warm Winter Outfits accessories. Underneath, she's wearing this long sleeve lilac colored shirt. It is ribbed and it's from the Purple Sparkle Approach with Purchase outfit. I think purple really suits Samantha, but I'm not going for a full purple look here. So these are the tweed shorts from the third Truly Me Mix and Match collection, and these are just some black tights from American Girl. I recently got Be Forever Kit's gardening outfit overall set. These boots are really cool, and they're this fun caramel tan color. Something fun that I noticed is the bottom of Kit's boots are super similar. On the left are Kit's historical boots that you could purchase separately, and I've had those for probably 10 years now. And then on the left are the new boots that came with her gardening outfit. Landon is my truly me number 41. She has really cute black curly hair, so I've left it down except for the front part that I've twisted back. She is wearing the Snow Good to See You Perch with Purchase outfit. This sweater material is really good quality. It's thick and cozy, and the snowflake in the middle has these little gems on the ends. The bottom skirt is attached to the sweater and is a very lightweight material. These gray socks are tall and stiff, and they are from the 1999 Girl of Today plaid skirt and sweater outfit. And these boots are from an old My American Girl Doll Meat outfit. I believe it was called the True Spirit outfit. And this was back when the My American Girl Dolls had charms with every outfit. So the little butterfly on the side is the loyal charm icon. This is Molly and she's a historical doll. I got her quite a few months ago, but she hasn't made it to the YouTube channel yet. I got one very used off of eBay and then sent her to the doll hospital and came back with this head. I recently got the Be Forever Molly from Costco and they look pretty different, but they're both really cute. She is wearing one of my very favorite Mary Ellen outfits. This is her ice skating dress. I love how it's kept one solid red color and really good quality. It really makes the white stand out and makes the most of the snowflakes. And I think it's a really nice touch that the circle skirt is lined in this blue satin. These blue tights are from the Truly Me Ombre Ballet outfit and these black and white boots are from historical Murray Grace's meat outfit. And lastly is Julie. She is a Be Forever doll from 1974. I haven't taken her coven braid out yet, so I just made another one on the other side and tied it to the back. This adorable little earthy leaf choker necklace is from the 2004 Weekend Fun Just Like You outfit. And for the rest of her outfit, she is wearing the warm winter outfit from 2015, in which my Be Forever Samantha is wearing the vest that goes with it from the accessory set. I think the slight slanted angle of the sweater is a really fun touch. These purple leggings are American Girl quality and are leg long. And these snow boots are so cool. I love how this knit pattern on the side is the same as the hat that goes in the accessory set. They even have rubber soles. And as another side note, they're the exact same bottom as these newer snowboarding outfit shoes that are currently available. Here is one last look at all of them together. I'd like to thank you so much for taking the time to watch my video, and I hope you guys all have a great rest of your day.